you ain't got time to tell me how you feel By this time tomorrow I'll be out in Bakersfield Just like that horse steady running down the track You know I won't be coming back I keep it moving down 75 Just like I've been doing for my entire life And if I win, go have to give my baby some You know that woman, she ain't done Can't stop till my work is done Run, horse Run, horse, run Pass the cards around See trouble coming because I know that sound Lovers, they will quit you A thief will rob you blind Good friends are awful hard to find Can't stop till my work is done Run, horse Run, horse, run Till my work is done Run horse Run horse run Giddy up yeah! Okay guys, so it's a beautiful morning in the middle of March and I am doing something that I have never done before. So I have the broadcaster on the tractor. And I am top dressing uh, wheat that was planted into soybean ground. And a little bit of my thinking there is that wheat uh, behind soybeans, you always do a real good job getting test weight and getting yield, but you don't always get protein. And so, as uh, you know, organic farmers need to keep experimenting and pushing the envelope. And so, uh, one of the things that we're going to try this year is we're going to try top dressing uh, some of the wheat. And uh, this particular product, Sustain, it is Omri listed, and I did get approval for my certificate before I used it, but. Uh, it calls for a very low rate, and I don't know that it shows it right here. Uh, but it did on the it did on the website where I was figuring it out. Uh, but anyway, what we're aiming for is about uh, 80 to 100 pounds per acre uh, top dressing on winter wheat. And uh, the product does call for soil incorporation. Uh, it is a, uh, you know, composted turkey litter. Uh, but since we are out before the first rain of the year and the ground is cracked open, uh, it probably has a chance of going in. And so we'll fill the spreader and we'll get to work. Okay guys, so I came out into the light. I wanted to show you the product there. And it was a little bit tricky getting the gate set up but I've kind of got it figured out now the ground speed so the nice thing about that stuff is it is going through a broadcast uh, broadcast applicator uh, you know with a gate on it and uh, I am able to control the flow the trick was getting you know the ground speed set right so 